Hello, 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 Galactic Peach here. I am Glasgow's alien artist, and I am ready to show you the summer sweet treats launch that Lush have recently done for summertime. And um, basically, we're going to have body sprays, shower jellies, giant ones as well, and fun bars too. So come and join me and have some fun. Woo! So first, we're going to build our way up, and then finish with the star of the show. Now if you want to see the star of the show, the body sprays, that's going to be at the end. So, you know, you could slide through, but I would rather you watch the whole video. So, come along. start off with the fun bars now we've got some here so we've got gold kind of match in the background we've got orange also match in the background and quicksand oh, god doing quicksand they're like play-doh and you can use them to mold different shapes different things i'm going to do something as well i'm going to make a little peach one because why not it's basically something you can use to create bubble bath body wash all different stuff. Oh my goodness, it's very, it's very, like, it's been sitting out for a couple of days, so it has kind of started to melt a wee bit, but I'm going to make like a little peach out of it, basically. So, you've got all different ones. Now, um, you obviously have in all the shops the original, like, Rainbow Fun, but, um, oh, this smells so good. It smells like orange juice or something. I'm actually obsessed. And, um, yeah, I actually had like a bit of green rainbow fun um, the other day, but I can't really find it now. So we're just gonna have a peach without a without a little green like um, whatever it's called. It kind of looks like a bum cheek, but oh well, it's a bit rubbish. But <laughs> I love these new nails I got. They're so like pretty. Oh my god. But um, yeah, if you want fierce nails, go for Alien Claws because they're iconic if you're in Glasgow, of course. But um, yeah, so you can mould it like Play-Doh, basically. Woo! It's very economical as well. You can get loads of uses out of it. And with the Rainbow Fun, they have all different colours and um, all different scents for each colour as well. And same with the separate ones, you can now buy like the individual colours as well and they all smell different. And there's wee exclusive ones as well, ones that go in the dark, ones that are silver, metallic. Um, almost like this one's gold, like it's actually golden colour, which is so cool. It's actually got a shimmer inside it as well, which is plastic free, so it's not going to harm the environment. I want to show you the quick sand one. This one's really cool. It's got like actual sand in there, so you can use that to like exfoliate with as well. This one would be really nice before like you shaved your body or something like that. Oh my god, it's very gooey. My recommendation is to maybe keep them in the fridge or something. If you are quite a big Lush fan, you'll know that you can do that with your face masks and stuff. But um, yeah, it's so cool. I'm actually going to show you how it works anyway since I've, I've got it here. But this one's like quick sand, it's very thick. I'm just going to get a bit of water, I'll be back in a sec. So this stuff lathers up so well. It's so nice and it's got sand in there so it's going to exfoliate like I said earlier. But oh my goodness, it smells amazing. It's like coconut or like chocolate or something, like chocolate orange. Oh, she reminds me of like Sonic Death Monkey. Oh, it's so nice. Oh my goodness, I put too much of it on, but it looks so like, so moisturizing. So, oh, I just hit a really like good note of it there where it was like so chocolatey, like, oh my God, obsessed. But yeah, I'm gonna wash this off now because it looks a bit funky. But that was the fun and um, really cool. I hope you enjoyed that. Next, we're moving on to the shower jellies. Ugh. Oh my goodness. So I have used it up already because I loved it. But um, it's so sparkly, that's the packaging. And there is now a ginormous version of it available for a limited time. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna take it out in a wee minute, but I'm gonna show you the other ones first before we get on to this big whopper. Oh my goodness. But basically, you know, I had to get it because I am a collector. Hmm, totally not. But we've got some different ones. I have had pretty much all of them, not to brag. 
Oh, are you? Are you sure about that, dog? <laughs> But um, I thought I would get a few that I've had already because I wanted to feel the nostalgia. But I've got some new ones as well. There's like um, one here called Gong. Now this one's like basically, um, oh, it smells so good. It's around, I'm gonna find the price for you, but I think it's like seven pound to about 7.50. But basically, I think the Bouncer Castle's 7.50. Get your hands on it, but it stops last in the shops. Um, as it is originally a party exclusive of the Bouncy Castle for a limited time you get to buy it, which is exciting. But this one smells like um, Golden Pear, which was a body spray that came out years ago and then came back recently for the community release of the body sprays. Not this one, but the one that just went like a, like in, I think it was November or something. And then you've also got this one, Sweetie Pie. Now this isn't part of the launch that's like the exclusive ones, but this is more part of the Discon range. It's basically the comforter, so um, I will take it out and let you see them as well because I have used these by the way, so they are starting to kind of fall apart a wee bit, but oh my goodness, it's making a, a strange noise, let me tell you that. I'll show you the gong one as well, but yeah, the sweetie pie one is really nice. Yeah, this one's like the, the gong one, it's um, yeah, gong, it's called, I forget all the names. Um, launch, lush or launch, and so much stuff, I just keep forgetting like how to. Can't keep up with it all, but look how sparkly that is. It's so beautiful. Like, oh my goodness. <gasps> oh, she's gorge. But straight back in the pot and on to Bongo. Bongo, Bongo, Bongo. I can't, I cannot speak. Bongo, Bongo, Bongo. So this is Bongo. As you would imagine from me just going bongo, bongo, bongo. But this one's um, like orange and it's got like a wee kind of clear top as well. And this is my favourite one, it's kind of like fruity, really like mango passion fruit, it's so nice. And then you've got Crash, which is in the Celebrate Scent, and this holds a like special place in my heart because there used to be um, Celebrate Scent sold like um, during Christmas and then they stopped it and I've not smelled anything celebrated in ages because they've not done anything in ages in the Celebrate Scent. So this is like the only thing I can get my hands on at Celebrate Scented. Uh, except from like, I think there was a body lotion last year, but it's pretty rare that Lush does celebrate stuff now, but this one's like um, neon yellow as well, it's so cool. I love it. And now finally, we're gonna go on to Bouncy Castle. So let's open it up. Now this one here, while well, I open it up, I'll, I'll explain, but basically, oh, oh, oh my goodness. It is one of those things um, that is gonna be limited, so you, can um, buy them um, in shops depending on like stock and stuff like that and um, they are like a shop exclusive but basically um, this sucker is £50 so you know get your hands on one if you can and oh my goodness I'm trying to get it out oh this is crazy oh oh my goodness it's massive Jesus oh oh my goodness this is Oh, this is heavy. I do not want to break it, but it's absolutely massive. Do, 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 do. Oh my goodness. It smells amazing. And um, I think I heard someone saying it's like strawberry twin tub scented or something. Um, or two timing tart, or whatever that's called. <laughs> two timing tart. Um, your two timing tart. Um, it's supposed to be like a strawberry kind of um, scent and it's supposed to be like that nostalgic vibe of like when you were a kid and you used to want to bounce the castle and then there'd be like shower, um, not shower jellies, cause, I mean, yeah, I would be worried if you ate them at a kid's party. Please don't eat them, I just got my words all mixed up. Well, it'd be cool to have them at a party, we do have them at the lush parties, but basically this, if I can get to the point, is um, it's basically to kind of be that nostalgia from when you were a kid and you used to get like ice cream and jelly and stuff like that and you would be going to someone's party and you would be bouncing on the bouncy castle and stuff like that but let's try and see if I can catch it. Woo! Oh my goodness, I panicked. I was like, oh no, I'm gonna drop it. <laughs> but that is bouncy castle and it's two kilos so it's heavy girl as you can see why I'm, I'm grunting and going, oh, I can't lift it. But we're gonna pop it right back in. <laughs> oh my goodness, that was crazy. And off we go. Oh my goodness, that scent really does stick to you. Like, it really sticks onto your body. 
so nice. I love it. I love anything like strawberries. A lot of people don't like strawberry scents, but I love strawberries because it reminds me of like those um, things you would get as a kid, like the little um, strawberry laces. They still do them as well, but oh my god, literally obsessed with that stuff. I was obsessed as a kid. But next, oh, I'm out of breath. <sighs> We're on to the body sprays and it's the community launch. This is the second time I have seen a body spray community launch and um, in less than a year, two body spray launches, which is crazy because launch, launch, lush, just never stop launching. But we've got them all here. Now I do um, have four of the ones that are being sold at the moment, but there is two um, that I didn't get. So I do technically already have them as they're basically the exact same but they just got repackaged um, basically. Um, so if you want like another chance to buy them, um, this is your chance. So um, those were like the um, Sticky Dates body spray and the Princess Peach one. Um, I've had them already so I was like I'm not going to buy them just because I need to save money girl. And um, I can't afford to be buying two of the same body spray that I don't even, not going to lie, I don't even use it that much. But um, we've got sticky dates here, this one's lovely and um, I'm pretty sure I'll put the price up and stuff like that but I think they're all £25 um, so this is like in the sticky dates scent, you know like the shower gel, the body scrub and I've heard that apparently um, the lip scrub as well is all coming back so like the body scrub, body lotion and the um, lip scrub are all coming into the kind of range um, I don't know if it's all year round or whatever really, I haven't really explained but it's online right now which is so exciting don't know how long it's going to be there for, if it's going to be like all year round, who knows but um, it's really exciting because now you can have a full sticky dates like kind of um, like body care routine, um, full top to toe basically um, and this one is so popular, it's so popular, like, lots of people on TikTok love it and um, it's really one of those kind of like viral products as well so you know go and get it before it goes because it has been flying off the shelves let me tell you that. So this is the Princess Peach Body Spray but now it's been sold as peaches which is really exciting that it's back because everyone loved it and I'm going to spare you back because why not? Oh, it's so nice. And I don't know why, but I kind of fell out of love with it when it first came out. But now I'm smelling it again. It's made me like fall back in love with it. So I'm kind of happy that Lush brought it back as well because it's like made it even more popular now. But hopefully they make more stuff in this scent as well because they do have the Thermal Waves Bath Bomb, which is a new one that just came out for Worldwide Bath Bomb Day. And it's in the same scent. So if you love that, you'll love um, this body spray. But basically, um, I love this one. It's really like fruity, campacha or champacha. There's also like um, Lipsy Kibeba. It's really like fruity, kind of really fizzy. Like, it's just so good. But that is Princess Peach, or as it's been launched as right now, Peaches. Um, but yeah. And um, the packaging for it is like an orange, so I'll put up a photo. And same with Sticky Dates, the Sticky Dates one has like a brown kind of one as well, which is quite cool. Now moving on to the ones that I got, which is Grape Soda. I love Grape Soda, it's so nice. Now we had a um, bath bomb at Valentine's Day. Oh, it's so nice, oh my god. It reminds me of like nostalgic, like love heart sweeties. Um, but it's this bath bomb here, I can't remember the name of it. I do know it, but I just keep forgetting because I've got the head of a sieve, honestly. But it's in the exact same scent and it's so nice. I absolutely love it. And um, you've also got Space Girl, which is another returning one. And this one is so nice. Oh, it's so good. Kind of reminds me of Parma Violets a wee bit. And it's really lovely. It's got, pretty sure it's got bergamot in there. Let's see. Yes, bergamot. It's got grapefruit, almond oil, so nice, love this one. And I did have one but it was starting to go, I'd had it for like, don't, don't do this, but I've had it for like five, six years. So I was like, I need to give it to somebody else, pass it on to another life. But basically, I was like, I cannot deal with that. No, I think I actually used it up. I just used, tried to use it up basically, because it was a bit fusty. Um, once you've had them for so long, just because Lush is obviously so fresh, you want to use it well fresh is best. But basically, um, I don't recommend keeping it for that long. But um, use it up as fresh as you can as soon as you get it. But um, the Space Girl one is back, so I was like, I need to get a new one of that because I haven't had it in ages and I love it so much. 
um, it's such a nostalgic scent as well. Then next um, um, we've got like Lemony Flutter which um, we have in a cuticle butter I'll go and show you. This is the Lemony Flutter here that's the same as that and we're now coming out with um, ones that are in a small size as well. Um, so like a little tin and it's only like £3 as well because Lemony Flutter literally lasts you ages and it's like 10, 11 pounds or something, which is amazing. So the fact you've got in a wee small travel size is like candy as well, just to keep in your pocket. Um, I need to get one honestly, because this is hard to carry around sometimes, but um, I need it always on the go, because of my nails now as well, because I get my nails done. Um, Alien Claws, because <laughs> Alien Claws recommended it to me, and I was like, I need to, because I work in Lush, so why don't I have it already? But I became obsessed with this, and then I was like, okay, I want to get into like Mini Flutter before this comes out, and now, it's made me fall even more like mad head and heels love with this um, but it's so good it's got like lemon sherbet vibes oh my god it's so good this one was so popular in my shop as well it's like sold so quickly and um, it's got sicilian lemon oil chamomile blue oil it just smells like lush like i love it lavender oil to jet to, 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 to jetty's oil but it's so nice it's got a kind of like smoky background to it but it's got that kind of lemon fizz, like sherbet, like thing, like vibe. It's so good. It's like proper summer kind of scent as well. And then you've got passion, which is really cool. Do 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 passion. More energy. More energy. More do 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 do. I don't want to get like um, copyrighted for it, but that's what it reminds me of every time I see it. But this is my favourite one. That's why I like left it to last. But oh my god. <laughs> do, 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 do. Fierce drag. God, sorry, I'm sure like cover the camera now. There's a shower gel for Valentine's Day and it's really starting to build popularity. So I was like, please, we need a body spray. And they finally listened and we're getting a body spray. Woo! So this is my favorite. It has lime oil, let's see if you oil, Brazilian orange oil, and there's another ingredient, but I'm not gonna lie, I can't be bothered to, to pick off the sticker. Plus I've got these nails on, so I don't want to damage it. But yeah, fierce drag. So that's the passion body spray, that was all the body sprays and that was pretty much it, so thanks for watching. I'm on a live right now. Hi guys. Oh my god. Fierce <laughs> <laughs> drag. <laughs> what did you kick? Your mom. I am your mom. Galactics, your mom.